Hello, hello, superheroes. <gasps> Who am I? Am I Captain America? Goodness gracious, <laughs> no friends. This is Miss Garcia getting ready to give you the morning message. So I found this really cool Captain America mask that goes for your eyes with the letter, that's right, A. A, and who starts with the letter A? Aubrey and Abigail, those are your classmates, friends. So today is Monday and we are going to write the morning message. So remember, when I say ice on me, you say ice on you. Ready? Ice on me. Yes, you say ice on you. One more time. Ice on me. Thank you so much, friends, for saying eyes on you. Give yourself some money. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Awesome, friends. Well, I have my superhero jacket on because I am ready to be a superhero and learn a lot. So, we're going to do the morning message on my big board because I was noticing that on the paper, I run out of room, friends. So we have been talking about families, right? We said that in our families, we have a father takes care of the families and mothers take care of the families. And we also saw um, animals, the, um, the chicken and the chick, remember that? So today we are going to talk about where do families live, friends? So where do you live? So let's see. I have my red marker because remember, with my red marker, I do my capital letters. Those are the big letters. And this is going to be a question. So ready? I'm going to say where. Where? W. W, where does your family live? Ready, friends? Where does your, I don't have enough space, so I'm gonna come down here. Where does your, family live and this is a question that I'm making friends so when I do a question I put my question mark where does your family live how many words do you hear in that sentence friends how many yep one two, three, four, five. So let me go ahead and get my expo marker and let's underline the words. Ready, friend? One, two, three, four, five. Let me write the number. One, two, three, four, five. Where does your family live? It's today's morning message. And we are also going to do a little different, friends. Instead of, in addition to underlining, we are going to tap our laps. So this is what I want for us to do. So put your hands on your lap and we're going to tap how many times we hear. Ready? Where does your family live? How many times did you tap? Let's do it again. Where does your family live? 
five times, friends. You tapped five times. And that is how many words are in the sentence, where does your family 